All right. Uh, Joe, um, I'm going to eat crow now for a little bit because the, <laughs> uh, the PlayStation portal is sold out in Japan, man. Wow. Uh, what the heck? Uh, it was sold out, sold out for a while in the, uh, U S store. Um, but then it came back and, um, I'm not sure if it's sold out anymore uh, this for the pre-orders, but it was sold out for a while and then it came back uh, uh, for a bit, I think, directly with Sony. But in Japan, man, 12 hours, dude. And it's gone. <laughs> it's, what the heck, man? What the heck? What? I'm gonna, who wants this? <laughs> I guess people want it, right? <laughs> I mean, bro, I thought, like, I, I thought that this was going to be a complete dud. So yeah. I'm kind of happy that that there <laughs> that there's actually people that want to have this device, and, uh, and something that I mentioned to you is that uh, it, you know Japan doesn't have the infrastructure problem that that we have here, um, and you know they have basically reliable internet uh, readily readily available uh, in most places, so. You know, maybe this is something that people do want. It's like, oh, I want to carry this thing around. I, I mean, unless the messaging over there was different, right? Which I doubt. Yeah. Because, yeah. I mean, I think the messaging that Sony put out there was pretty clear what this thing is, you know, what what this device is. So I'm, I'm, I doubt that there's a messaging problem and, and people in Japan think that this is just handheld. Um, in which case, this bodes well for Nintendo. Oh, because I will. I guess we can we can probably stitch the the two, sure. uh, the two stories together. But um, yeah, man, what what do you think? I mean, it, it, are are people actually excited for it, or what's up with this? Yeah, I I actually do think that specifically, like, I think the the PS Portal, like you said, it could not be more than two hundred dollars. Well, they do. They hit it exactly on the price point. Um, the other thing is. The games that you get on PlayStation, like you can sell your consoles, you can sell your infrastructure when you have good games. What a concept, Obed. So like for the fact that there's a demand for the PlayStation portal, like is not entirely shocking. It's shocking because um, that's not how I perceived it to be at launch. I thought it would just be a, you know, a casual purchase. But I mean, look, if the demand's that high, we are seeing a movement yeah. in mobility. We are seeing obviously the uh for the switch culture, you know, where people are at like that versatility. And that's exactly what this is. Like it's this it's the same thing as a switch with the way that it's set up from its versatility. I just it's just the pricing. Um, it's the, the lack of, of it being um independent and actually being a streaming device that doesn't get me too excited. But I mean even I've joked about it, but I'm like, Obed, like, you know, it doesn't look that bad when you start to think about all things considered. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I mean, I guess, and I, and I again, go, going back to the specs and what the info that's out there. Um, I mean, from, from, again, what I'm reading, it does, you can't even run, you can't even buy this device, subscribe to PlayStation Plus Extra and and get games like this is strictly no. a remote play device like yeah. this is the sign for remote play um i i i don't know man i again I, it's not for me i'm not disparaging anyone that wants it and and you know uh much less the, the japanese audience right so um it's just that it's it's hard for me to grasp. I guess that's what what it is. Um, I know that there has potential, like you know, for I guess le less than <laughs> reputable, uh, uh, you know, things to do to it, right? But it's uh, at least for me, man. I just don't feel like. I would rather spend my two hundred dollars on something else. I would rather buy mm. some AirPods Pro, and, and and not and not go in this route. So I would rather get the the head the the 
the the the wireless earbuds that they're coming out with uh that they haven't put out a date as, as far as i know but uh yeah i would rather i would rather get that honestly so i don't know man it's it's interesting it's very very interesting but again uh you know kind of like stitching it together like if i'm nintendo right now after watching this i would be really excited for what they're yeah, you gotta cooking feel good. yeah I'll be really excited for what they're cooking because if this is a strictly remote play device that you can't natively run anything in it um, and you're coming out with a, you know, a, a PS4 Pro level handheld next year, I mean, they got to play it right, though. They can't right. go they can't go too crazy. And, and I mean, no one Nintendo, they're... They, they they they're usually pretty conservative with their pricing, right? But like I, I personally don't think that this thing should be more than four hundred dollars. Um, honestly speaking, um, you could make the argument that you could push it to five hundred. And um, it, it better though run some real good. Yeah, graphics. that's the thing, right? Because um, you can get the the an ipad air with an m1 chip that an m freaking m1 chip that you can right. run everything on it if they want it they could you could run everything on an m1 right and you know i know that there's naysayers out there it's uh m, know. m chips are the real freaking deal it, coming we, from we an, know. coming from an it guy yeah you got you guys have no clue so <laughs> <laughs> um the okay yeah so you can get you can get an ipad and that's with the apple tax on top of it right i mean nintendo has their own tax they have their own nintendo tax but they usually tax you on their games where where mario is you know odyssey still 60 dollars. it's been out for right. for six years or whatever so that that's how they get you right they they have their game tax on it but on the console itself, I think that again they they shouldn't go they shouldn't go more than four hundred. If you ask me, right, um, I will start phasing out the the base Switch models and move the OLED to two ninety nine, and and just put and then make this one four ninety nine. Okay. Because I mean, you could make the an argument, right? Because of you know inflation and 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 production costs and all that going up uh they had to move production and all that so 450 yeah I, I don't i don't think you should get to 499 440 i think 449 should be your max 400 is just like 399 is a sweet spot 449 has to be your max anything mm -hmm. after that you, you're losing me so I love yeah. Nintendo and all their games, right? And I really want this device, but <laughs> you know, you you can't you can't push me too hard. So you can get a play, you can get a PS Five for three ninety nine, right? Right. So and you're talking about a console that's, you know, what two and a half times more powerful based on yeah on specs that are out there floating I don't know, on the internet's, so. You can't get too crazy, but yeah, you'll. I mean, what what do you think on uh, on that? Because those rumors are ramping up. Yeah, I I really do agree with you. Like Nintendo has to be very excited about their future, and I think that from a pricing standpoint, they will get it right. I don't think that they're gonna surprise us and be like, it's five hundred and fifty dollars. Six six. I don't think we're gonna see that. Nintendo, they've been there, done that. Um, we they. They know the Switch is just so, so good. So, so successful. That's why they, they run with it when they could have already done the yeah. Switch 2. They could have already dropped this new iteration. And they've run with it for so long because of how happy people are. And I love that strategy. I don't imagine them to be radically different. And I agree with you. Uh, I, I think that if they go at the $400 level, they'll, they'll scale back the cost of the current iteration down a, little, a lot significantly. Um, and I think that, you know, the overall game experience is what they're going to continue to sell people on, you know, the versatility, the games that they have, and then just 
around the um, the tech itself. Like you're gonna be like, oh wow, I can actually run this thing on my Switch. Great, I'm in it. Um, maybe there'll be some partnerships coming out with it, like you mentioned. Maybe some more Game Pass stuff going on there, or something that that could be surprising to that extent. Um, yeah. But no, I, I really do think they're in a sweet spot. I do think that the excitement is there. And yeah. you thought the Switch One was record breaking. If they do what oh, we're man. expecting for the second one, this is going to break all the records. Yeah. Mark my words. Yep. Um, and Nintendo also confirmed that support for the original Switch uh, is scheduled to go through summer of 2025. So two years i don't think um i think with with the switch's extensive library and this is coming out plus getting another year of support um i think that this bodes well for the device to be backwards compatible they they mm -hmm. gotta dude because at mm -hmm. this point you know you you have to and if they're using an nvidia ship it's gotta be right yeah. and um, you know, Nintendo's done it with their handhelds before. Well, you know, the the, the Game Boy Advance was was backwards compatible with the Game Boy uh, uh, DS was compatible with the Game Boy Advance and Game Boy, right? Going back, um, so there there is um, there is a there is a history of that. So I think uh, in this case, uh, they they should continue that trend. Especially because yeah. the this you know this it, it is technically a handheld device, so um, I just wish that they would give me the option of buying a consoleized version of this and not a portable device, because if a yeah, portable device yeah. doesn't really do anything for me, right? Uh, like yeah. I ninety ninety nine percent of the time that I play Switch, it's docked thing is cost wise how would you do that would you because if you get if the docked gives you the same thing and you say you want to have one that's a docked only in essence like what goes higher what goes lower how do you handle that? so so what if you do right you do you do your uh, and again it's like okay hear me out this is gonna sound crazy but what if you could do your hybrid like the switch with the joy cons and and you know the your tv dock and all that for 500 and then do a, a version that's just a console with a pro controller for 400 okay you know you don't have a screen it's basically the same system without a screen and a and you know a, and a, a pro controller or the even the joy cons but no screen no portability to it and it's on and off cheaper I mean, you can sell it for cheaper, but sure. You know, I mean, that's... The Joy-Cons are still compatible with it if you really wanted to. It's like on an individual basis. Exactly. It would make sense for you, but like if there's yeah. certain games that need that. Okay. Yeah. So. I like it. Yeah. I mean, that would, that would be that, that would be a good option, but I think this is going to be like straight up uh, a hybrid again. I think that's yeah. that's their that's their future. They, they proved that they um, they can pull it off. And and again, we're seeing it as like the, it's it, it's in, <laughs> it's it's crazy, right? When you when you play Zelda, and Zelda looks great. And don't get me wrong. And and, and again, the, that game is magic. I don't know what that game does. Like the, it's 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 incredible. Um, but then you go back and and you watch like Spidey's coming out, dude, and it looks insane. And and that game is probably gonna have like a you know, a, a, a 1440p ray tracing 60 FPS mode or something. I can't wait. It's going to look insane. So, yeah, uh, it, it, they, they're, it's, it's tough, right? I don't think they're, they're, they, they'll ever be at that level, but, uh, you know, they, they, got a, they got a good chance of, you know, coming at least somewhat close. So, 